When filling your own oxygen cylinders, you can extend the life of high-end pressure on your oxygen supply tanks by cascading multiple supply tanks. Instead of discarding supply tanks, which can no longer fill your destination cylinder all the way, cascading supply tanks uses the available pressure of partially empty tanks to fill your cylinder before tapping into the high pressure of your fullest tanks. This allows you to utilize as much pressure as possible from each supply tank before replacing it. Let's go over what you'll need to cascade multiple oxygen supply tanks together. First, you'll need several supply tanks from a local oxygen supply provider. Next, you'll need a cylinder intercoupling kit for each supply tank you are adding beyond the first. In our example, we'll be using four supply cylinders, meaning we'll need three intercoupling kits. Finally, you will need a transfill hose to connect your oxygen supply array to the destination tank. To learn more about our different transfill hoses, and to go over the transfill process step by step, take a look at our How to Fill Your Own Cylinder tutorial. When setting up your supply array, you'll want to label each supply tank so you can easily identify how full each tank is compared with the others. At Mountain High, we do this by labeling our supply cylinders from 1 to 4. We keep number 1 on the emptiest tank, number two on the next emptiest, and so forth, with our fullest cylinder marked as number four. We use an easily removable label because we need to renumber our tanks when we replace a supply tank in the array. Here's how to set up an array. With your supply tanks marked, make sure all your supply tank valves are off, and connect an interconnect hose to tank one. Each interconnect will come with a hose and a T. Connect the other end of the hose to one of the straight ends of the T, and the perpendicular end to tank two. Use your next interconnect hose to connect to the remaining straight end of the T, and connect the other end of the hose to another T, which will connect to tank three. Continue the process in the same manner, with each interconnect hose connected to the straight ends of the T, and the perpendicular end of each T connected to a supply tank. As you connect each hose and each T, be sure to snugly tighten each fitting with a wrench. Once you've connected a hose and a T to the last tank, in our example that's tank number four, your array is all set up. Now you can connect your transfill hose to the open end of the remaining T on the last supply cylinder, and follow the transfill process as you normally would, but with a new strategy. Before we get into the process, let's first go over the basic idea of cascading supply tanks. Let's start with four full supply tanks. In this scenario, we'll only be using one supply tank, tank number one, for transfilling our refill cylinders until it cannot reach the maximum pressure rating of our refill bottles. Let's say we're regularly filling an AL15, or D bottle, with a maximum rated pressure of 2015 PSI. Once supply tank one's pressure has fallen below 2015 PSI, it will not be able to fill our bottle completely. For example, if supply tank one's pressure is at 1800 PSI, we can still use supply tank one to fill our bottle to 1800 PSI. Then we can use supply tank two to fill our bottle the rest of the way to 2015 PSI. As we fill bottles now, we will continue to use tank one first, followed by tank two, until tank two is no longer able to reach the maximum pressure rating of our refill bottle. At this point, we'll begin using tank three to cap off our bottles. As we fill our bottles, we continue using supply tank one first, and supply tank two second to preserve the high end pressure in supply tank three for as long as possible. Only when supply tank three cannot reach the maximum fill pressure on our refill bottles will we begin to use supply tank four. At this point, we introduce supply tank four and we are using the full array of supply tanks in sequence to get all the oxygen we can out of our partially empty supply tanks before we utilize the available high pressure in our full supply tank. The step-by-step -step process of filling your cylinder complete with guidance on safety and the proper fill rate, is covered in our How to Fill Your Own Cylinder tutorial. Additionally, before handling any oxygen equipment, be sure you are familiar with oxygen safety by reviewing our oxygen safety document found on the Ground Support Equipment page at mhoxygen.com. With the array set up and a transfill hose connected to it, connect your destination bottle to the transfill hose and open the valve on the destination bottle. Making sure your transfiller's valve is closed, you then open the valve on supply tank one. With both the destination bottle and supply tank one open, you can begin the transfill process by cracking open the valve on the transfill hose. As always, when transfilling, be sure to fill slowly and always check the maximum rated pressure of your destination cylinder before starting. 
All bottles are not the same. Once your bottle has reached the maximum pressure Supply Tank 1 can provide, close the transfiller valve, then close Supply Tank 1, and open Supply Tank 2. The cascading hose configuration allows you to bypass other cylinders without disconnecting hoses. Once Supply Tank 2 is open, you can slowly open the transfer valve again and resume filling your bottle until you've reached the maximum pressure Supply Tank 2 can provide. We then repeat the process of switching supply tanks by closing the transfer valve, closing the supply tank valve, opening the next supply tank valve, and filling with the transfer valve until we've reached the maximum pressure rating of the destination bottle. Cascading supply cylinders greatly extends the life of your supply cylinders and will allow you to spend less time and money exchanging supply tanks. By way of advice, in a cascading setup, Try not to open two supply cylinders at the same time. This will equalize their pressure and forfeit much of the pressure of the higher supply tank. Aww. You can find everything you need to cascade multiple supply tanks, including our CIC 540 cylinder intercoupling kit and all our transfill hoses at mhoxygen.com. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call.